I'm not late to the briefing, am I? We haven't started yet. I'm waiting on Miller. Still feel bad about punching Matt in the face. He'll get over it. Or he'll kill me in my sleep. That's always a possibility, too. Got whoa, whoa, guy, guys. Can we just get to murdering already? We got a problem. Now we're talking. What's up? The Zinn are coming. Here? That's probably why he said it's a problem. All right, let's take cover. We should be able to ambush them. Not so sure about that. Everyone keep taking away my superpowers. How the hell did they find us? I don't know. Who cares? Let's just kill them. On the next. There's too many of them. There's a helicopter on a nearby roof. We can use it to get everyone to safety. Everybody follow me. Matt and I will head out on our own. We what? Take care of your people. We'll catch up. Fine. Before we do anything, we need some breathing room. Let's take out those tanks. To the roof! Pierce and I will hold him here. Just get everyone else to safety, player. We got this! Whoa, why are we running? I'm down for some murder. Ben says he has a plan. We need to lose this heat and then... Whatever the plan was, it went out the fucking window. We need to focus on surviving. Hurry inside! Pierce and Ben are getting into that car. Let's cover them. On it. Damn, you are bow in the sky. Kinsey, where to? Okay, um, hold on, I'm scanning. Scan fast. Look, a UFO! Just like Johnny taught me. Yo, these Zen have some high-tech shit. What's their arsenal like? Oh, the Zen have all kinds of cool stuff. I wish I could get into their armory and see what they're prototyping. They even have murder bots. Murder bots? Now that's my kind of household appliance. Check it out, a UFO! The men are flying in! Good. 
find a safe place for Pierce and Ben to go. We're not going to my place. Everyone okay? You walked away, right? Oh, look, a cat. Fuck, with all the buildings in Steelport we crash on Genkies? Seriously? Super ethical reality. Where to now? Doesn't matter, the Zin just found us. Kenzie, find us a way out. On it. Ooh, is that a killing floor? Merry Christmas to me. Uh-oh. Kenzie, what uh-oh? Boss, the game is on. It started by itself. I can't shut it down. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special episode of Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Shit. Floor is active and the doors are locked. Nobody gets out. Including us. Until that is, the contestants rack up enough points to fill the murdometer. Shit, I'm down. Let's do this! <laughs> Better you than me. Look at all the contestants today. And all new targets as well. The Zen Empire have taken it upon themselves to face the challengers. Truly, a bold move on their part. You're not kidding. The Sin are the fiercest opponents in the universe, Bobby. They should be a tough fight for the Saints. Yes, indeed. The Sin are falling before the might of these they sure are. Look at how they're mowing down the opposition. It goes to show you how much having a team behind you can really come in handy. <laughs> I wish we had a team behind us. What we have is the love and support of Zinyak. What else could we possibly need? <laughs> Nothing at all, Bobby. Nothing at all. Just a yep, little bit longer. Enter the arena. It's always a special occasion when the professor takes the stage. Let's watch the master at work. That's Genki, huh? Yeah, he looks crazy. Aim for his big, stupid head. Boss, he's kind of helping us. Die, you fucking man cat. Good shot by the contestant. Genki's sure gonna feel that one. It takes a particularly skilled player to take on Professor Genki. Especially after facing the considerable might of the Zen Empire. Of which we are required to install the virtues. And there you have it, folks. Genki is down. 
down, but never out, Zack. So true, Bobby. So true. Is that all? Looks like it. Oh my gosh! What, more of them? Let's get to the prize room! That was fun. They got more games like this in Steelport? <laughs> oh, Kinsey's recording this. You know, I generally don't like getting involved in these things, but this is really exciting. Kenzie, focus. What do we do now? Ben's plan was to overload the simulation. We can still do that, but not if the Zen know our every move. But you can make sure they don't, right? Yes, but I need to get back to the ship so I can find a way to cut them off. Once that's done, it's just a matter of finding the weakest point in the simulation. Get us to a safe spot so we can get back to the real world. me all the time. Easy. Are you there yet? Hey. Player, Pierce and I are pulling out of the simulation. Meet you back on the ship. Where's that static coming from? And how did the Zen find us? I thought your hideout was safe, Kinsey. You alien fuck! Cold. The proximity alarm is screaming, and Asha Miller and the vice president are gone. They kidnapped Keith David and left us sleeping so we get picked up by Zinya. Too bad for them we're awake. I'm still standing! Clear out the lower decks! We have to hold the room! Fuck that! I'm not waiting for them to come to me! Red cylinder, huh? Big and glowy. Looks perfect. Here you go. I find something that looks important. This 
looks important. Let's blow it up. What was that? Yo, these bombs are hotter than we thought. Let's get the fuck out of here. Yo, quit fucking around and get in here. <laughs> I am awesome! That wasn't a bad fuck you to Zin. Let's get out of here and find Kenzie. God damn it! What happened? MI6 fucked us. I knew it! Asha had it out for me since jump! She talks shit in Pakistan, she sucker punched me Can't in. can't believe Miller had me fooled. To think I actually apologized. He's probably been working this angle for a while. Hell, he might have even been the one who tipped off Zinyak about Johnny. Doubt it. Dante said that the lowest circle of hell was reserved for betrayers. But it's important to remember that it's the storyteller who decides who the hero is, not morality. But while philosophers will spend years debating the ethics of the Kinsey Gambit, the Saints had a less charitable view. Keith David is a dead man. 